Come on, come along, and I'll just, I'm just gonna head straight in. Sorry. Okay, I follow suit, seeing as he's, he, he's found. You're yeah, sure you're gonna follow? Yes, I follow through. It's a big giant vortex ball of fire. It makes yeah, no he, sense. He he he's he's said he's seen something, so I need to see it for myself. Okay, well, surprise! You an anti-paladin wall. <laughs> what damage do I take? Uh, well. You're fine. It was mostly just a problem that, like, the Odo is a duck. <laughs> um, but yeah, you walk in and I, I, uh, your light your light illuminates the entire area, such that you can see a similar looking kind of illusory wall on the other side of on the other side, which you remember as being from like when you uh, came down here last time. And just off to the side of the direction out of that, you see what can only be remotely described as uh, space going down a drain and made of fire. Right. Can you do something to help me move? Because I can't actually move my character right now. Oh? Lying. I, I, I oh, need some information. I've been moving. Oh, no, that's why. Lying. I need some Sorry. information from you. I've sent you a message. Oh. Okay. Hang on. Is it possible? Can I roll knowledge arcana on this, or...? Uh, yes you may. Fantastic. Mungo's going to, uh, look very, very hard at Rise. And, um, just start staring at him <laughs> very... Sorry. Mungo's very gonna look very hard at what? At, at, not Rise. Um, sorry, I was thinking of a different campaign. <laughs> <laughs> I've got too many campaigns that I play in the sorcerers and stuff. Sorry, uh, <laughs> at Zora. Uh, yeah, Mungo's going to look at Zora very, very hard, staring deeply. His brow furrowed. His mind looks like an incredible, like there's an incredible mental battle going in there, going on in there. Um, I'm just gonna put this. I'm gonna cure the Odo because I love him. Okay. <laughs> mm hmm. <laughs> <laughs> That's what me for. Like, Even I don't know this... why I'm doing this. It's basically is this where um I mean what exactly has gone on here? Because I kind of tuned out for a little bit. <laughs> um, Zora and the Odo stuck their heads through the illusory wall. It right. was like staring into um. A space where, like, space is just sort of warping a little bit. Right. And Didn't the Odo got massively overwhelmed by this being a duck. <laughs> and took a whole bunch of non-lethal damage because they've basically gotten whiplash on their brain. <laughs> wow. And now me and Terry have entered through the wall. And so, I mean, I'm guessing that I would have gone along with somebody, right? It's up to you, have you? Yeah, yeah. Well, come in. Come on in. Hey there! Mungo, come on down! Um, okay, well then, <laughs> Mungo's now going to turn around to Tarry and whisper, Sorcerer, when you Mungo, you sorcerer friend. But, uh, this, the one that's doing all this? Be careful you how Mungo, you word this, be careful how you word this. <laughs> <laughs> when you Mungo, you get fought. When you mungo, you think kill sorcerer, <laughs> and she's just gonna <laughs> look over his shoulder at Zora. <laughs> like again, his face is just gonna go through a multitude of different expressions, from soft to angry, all while right. staring at um. Go. Calm down, okay. <laughs> if there's someone that needs punishing, then I'll let you know. But until that time, it's okay. When you mungo, you not kill Zora, sorcerer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, don't don't kill Zora. Zora is a friend. Okay. Uh, the ring you got, I don't think it was a ring. I gave you a wisdom necklace. Yeah, okay. you gave me the wisdom necklace. That was it. And the ring I got from the uh, store. But the guy said, uh, be careful. 
what how you use us like that. I'll be careful with it. Um, mm -hmm. but I didn't really pay much attention to him. Um, yeah. I mean, we also got the thing <laughs> about the other thing. Uh, you know, uh, a lot of gold required thing. Oh, the thing, the yeah, thing, that yeah, thing, yeah, that thing. The thing, the thing. I, spent, I think I spent a lot of that gold, didn't I? <laughs> <laughs> Um, oopsies! Right. Okay, Mungo's I... going to very suddenly go stock still and start going for his weapon. <laughs> am I so hearing? Or, am I hearing and seeing all this? By the way. Oh, you're seeing this. He was whispering to Tarry, so you're just seeing it. It wasn't made the lady fall for Mungo. It was the lady fall for me. But, but I did. I hear Tarry. Did Tarry whisper it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um. What? Apparently that Mongo wants to kill me, but uh Okay, well I'm gonna head to this side of the room. And then that's where I'll do the knowledge arcana thing. Uh, okay. Why why is the Odo still kind of Okay. Wasted? Uh did you like roll to heal him or? I did a uh, Q also. Light are you wound. sure in this instance that you want to use a heal you want to use a heal spell on him? I use Q light wounds. I did it ages ago. Okay. Really? How much? How much health did you cure? I didn't um, see the rule here. No, it's, it's a. Um, isn't it just a uh, effect that works? When lying your hands upon the living creature, the the you channel of positive energy and cure it one d eight points of damage plus one point per cast level. Okay, I didn't do that. Didn't realize that was a thing. Okay, my bad. Mm, one D eight plus um what cast level four? Five seven? Five? What cast level am I at now? <laughs> uh your caster level is the same as your druid level. Wait, seven. Which is seven, yeah. Okay, so I have a maximum of five, so I'll put five in there. Uh pure light means. Seven. It's a good job that I had the five. <laughs> okay, so you successfully managed to cure uh, De Odo of all of his non-lethal, and he wakes up with a start, pulling his head, yanking his head out of the water. Yay! <laughs> good job. Glad I could save him. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Zora, um, you're just staring at this thing that slightly defies explanation, really, um, and you're not really sure that you're 100% remotely qualified to actually judge what it is, but you can make a pretty dang good estimated, like, educated guess of, this is not natural. <laughs> okay, so basically I stare at this for a good minute. Is just... that ain't natural? <laughs> <laughs> no, he doesn't I don't say know that. what this is, but I'm sure it ain't supposed to be here. <laughs> That's pretty, okay, yeah, we'll put it that way. Pretty much a case of just, just incredibly fascinated by this. Just sort of skulking around it and just like eventually just sort of like come back to the group and says, I don't know what it is have any of you encountered this down here before no this is the first time seeing this thing <sighs> well uh, oh no wait Od Odo's a druid I keep thinking Odo's a sorcerer or a mage well I'm a sorcerer I'm going but... with you up there uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm almost assuming, like, tell, can I detect magic on it? On it? Yeah. Yeah. I'm still on the other side of the wall. Can I detect evil on it? Can Mungo uh, have unholstered uh, his weapon and started raising it? Yes. Uh, and he's slowly turning around to Zora. Mungo? Okay, I He's, like, back. visibly shaking as he's doing this. <laughs> As if he can't quite control his actions. Can I cast Charm Person <laughs> on him? Uh, you can. Do you want to cast Detect Magic first, or...? Uh, um, well, tell you what, I've got Detect... Tell you what, we'll do it on. this way. I've, I've got, got Detect got Magic on from Detect... Oh, do you mean... Detect, do you want me to Detect Magic on him, or on the thing first? Well, you said you were going to Detect Magic on the thing. Okay, so can we do it this way? Can we do it where I'm about to do it on the thing, but instead well, I turn and I end up casting it on him? 
I just want to say, Mungo is moving very slowly as well. So Yeah, but I'm noticing something very strange and the fact that you're sort of trying to not do it. So what can we say that I try? I was about to detect magic on the thing, but I turn and and, and cast it on him instead. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah. Um, you indeed do detect magic in the vicinity of Mungo. What do I detect? Uh, well, you detect like there's some dis there's some distinct uh, I guess transmutation kind of effects on uh, him in personally ver uh, as the like origin of a couple of different items that he's holding. Um. There's probably a few more there, but it's kind of hard for you to tell, but it's like behind the magical items. If you stare at him for a while, you might be able to piece them apart. But uh, meanwhile, Mungo does have an axe raised. Yeah. Uh, um, I... Can I pin him down? Can you? You know, you know like I did when he was trying to kill people. Uh, you can try. It'll be an opposed strength check, I believe. Yep. Uh. uh. Sorry, no, I was gonna, I was gonna, I was thinking whether to say, no, hold on, don't do anything yet. And just try. Right, okay. No, I'm just thinking he's, he's wielding an axe towards I, you. I know, I know, but, uh, before, I guess in my mind, I guess in his mind, it might be a case of, like, if you try to do that, it might just make it worse for Mao. I mean, you could completely ignore him if you want. I was going to say. Look, I know. Mal okay, well, I, I'll just, I'll, Zoro just sort of like steps back and just put his hands, sort of puts his hands in front of him and just like in a, you know, like a warding fashion. Just look, yep, Mungo. Waiting for a response. Mm -hmm. <laughs> He's just carrying on, but he can't like respond. He's just making grunting sounds. Um, is there any way? Is there a specific spell to dispel magic or anything like that, or would I have to have like taken uh, something to do that? Yeah, there is dispel. There is dispel oh, there is magic. Actually dispel ma okay, doesn't matter. There is dispel magic. <laughs> All right. Okay. Fair enough. Just wanted to make sure. No, you need to go um, on a I've mighty got, quest of a mountain of Jigalaf. Did, did um, I did I t detect evil through it? Would smite evil take that away from him? Uh, on the swirly vortex thing? No, on on, on Mungo. The spell magic would probably just be much easier. There is no it. evil on Mungo. Right, okay. Can I please go through the wall? <laughs> I've been trying to like, move through, but everyone's had a turn. I'm like, I'll go through the wall. I'll go through the wall. Yeah, you can. <laughs> Are you taking the Odo with you? Well, knowing what happened last time, yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously? I don't want him to be left alone. I'll 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 take him through, but I comfort him. Tell him it's okay. I don't worry. Don't be scared. I'm sure it's okay. The guys are in there. We'll be fine. <laughs> okay, well, as as you're just like holding the Odo like comfortingly and like uh, uh making sure he's he's calm and alright, you move through the wall and immediately see uh, Mungo about to hack Zora in half, basically. I can't actually move. <laughs> That's... Hmm. Yep, I can't move my character. You'll have okay. to move him. Got it. O Odo? Thank you. Don't, don't do anything. What, why? Why? What? <laughs> stand, okay. stand still. Stand still. Can I try casting Charm Person on him, then? Uh, I know, yes, you may. Because I know about this whole friend thing, so. Mm. Alright, so how does, does, how does the spell work then? Uh, well, uh, if it's if it's an unwilling recipient, which it generally is, then Mungo gets a uh, will save, mm. and if it works, then Mungo considers you to be a friend. Alright. Okay. So we'll try that okay. first. Um. I uh, take my sword out of its sheath. Can I just ask, just roleplay wise, how does this spell work? I'm just interested. Uh, it sort of like clouds their senses so that they perceive you as being like a dear and trusted friend and ally. Okay, so what am I, but what do I do? Like, am I saying stuff? Am I, you know, I just want to know roleplay wise. Um, if you've played Witcher, uh, it's sort of like, I think it's a, a, a Quen. 
charm. Like you, you say a few magic words, do a few magical finger movements, and like they. Oh, trust it's very, you, it's very much. These are not the droids you're looking for, sort of thing. <laughs> yeah, it's it's very much a kind of Jedi hand wave. Right. Okay. So I'll cast that just to myself and just on him. Okay. Rattle it. So, uh, Mungo, would you like to make a will say, please? True love's kiss will break the spell. Indeed. That's my <laughs> next move. Someone That's said, my next move right Someone Love Turtle said earlier, putting him in a rage might help. I disagree. <laughs> actually, putting him in a rage would actually increase his will. Um, I... <laughs> okay, 12, I think, is actually, like, too low to beat uh, one of Zora's spells. Even a low level one, like, uh, Charm Person. So, indeed... You are now under the effects of Charm Person, and you perceive Zora to be a close and trusted friend. Mongo's going to start crying whilst grimacing, and he's going to speed up his, like, movements towards you. Okay, <laughs> right. Can I, okay, in that case, can I um, cast Daze? Uh, yes, you may. Um, I'm trying not to hurt him here. <laughs> Odo? I've, I've got I, no I, choice I, now, I, Andy. I, need, I, need I know. To warn you. Get away from me. But why? Uh, uh, What's uh, going just, on? Just, just, just stay away. Go back to the wall. Stay away from me. Oh, I see what's happening. Battle music happening right now. Dead, 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 dead. I'm gonna go uh, Andy, over just, Zora. just as an as an alert. Um, Mungo's level is actually so high that days will not affect him. It will. You still try and cast it, but it. I, I got walk over to where Zora um, is. Andy, did you try using dispel magic already? I don't have dispel magic. That's the point. Oh if shit! I had, <laughs> if I had it, I would have used it right now. Um, <laughs> I wonder where you're going. Okay, well, I'm tell you what, I'm Zora. Okay, I need to get away from Tari. Um, I get. I'm gonna say just just knowing. I'm gonna say being an experienced sorcerer, I'm gonna know that maybe, maybe like a zero level spell isn't enough or something. Maybe, maybe, maybe because of how hard it was to even use a first level spell. If someone explains what's going on to me, I could then just dispel magic. Because all I see is Mungo's going crazy. Uh, You're doing something. I've got dispel magic. Uh, <laughs> so can, you can, I can, you can, can ask I, what's going can on. Can I say anything? I already asked what's going on several yeah. times. Though. Yes, you can. can. I say anything? Yes. Um, Odo, um, I'm getting the feeling I I need to kill you. This is not this is not me. Are you sure I, about I know, that? I know it's not me. That's why I'm asking you to stay away from me. You're fucking disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> I, I do it my you. Are you oh, sure no, it's I, not I you? I swear, I can't it, it, control no, it, myself. It, right. I I can't control this. I think it's something to do with this portal thing. I think we need to get try and find a way of getting out of here as soon as possible. I have an idea. Right, I'm going to use Dispel Magic. <laughs> okay. Finally, someone decided to do it. <laughs> He's the only one who has the spell. I know. <laughs> how do we use? How do we use? Oh, Lying. A... Yes. Mongo is going to attack. <laughs> okay. Zora and Mungo, I presume, then. Well, just basically everyone who's going to be involved in this. Roll for initiative. Sure thing. <laughs> Okay. I, I can't help it, man. I know, it's fine. Uh, initiative is, um... He's What's rolling. your initiative bonus again? 1d20 plus your dexterity, basically. Oh, so. It's been a while. Oh! Oh my god. <laughs> so, Zora, 15. Mungo, 16. Uh, Tari and Odo? Hmm? Try to find mine. Should dex. dex. Yeah, it should just... Unless you have, like, the improved initiative feed, it's just your dex. So, uh, for you, Odo ability. is plus one. I won. <laughs> I know that. <laughs> now I'm learning. I'm learning. It's been 23 streams. I'm learning. <laughs> 1d20 plus one. Dex. 11. <laughs> wow. Not ten. Okay. But... okay, so eight, twelve, sixteen, and eleven. Eight? Who got the eight? Sorry, like fifteen, beg your pardon. <laughs> no, 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 no. Sorry. Sorry, I got sixteen. Okay. Ah, oh, two oh. sixteen. Seems I've over there. Okay. 
That means Mungo goes first, so... Oh, Andy. It's okay, if that happens, it happens. No, 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 I just realised what feat I just in I, uh, I put into this guy. I, I haven't even been young using Mungo to his full potential. This isn't even Mungo's final form. <laughs> <laughs> um, I've got two weapon fighting, right? Right. And with my... Right, basically yep. I've got two attacks per turn, okay? And with those two attacks, I get two hits because um, I've got an Orcish double axe, which counts as two weapons. Yeah, I right? remember this, yeah. And because I've got improved two weapon fighting, I also get a third um, hit. Well, basically, um, I get a third hit off of the um, two weapons. Dude, just do it. Don't it, just, oh, just, just do it. Just do it. Dude, you can't help this. Do it. Do it. <laughs> but I don't want to kill you. Just do it! <laughs> So, um, okay, so... Shia LaBeouf it, man. Andy, are you serious? D no, it's gonna happen. Just fucking do it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Just cry. Okay, so I'm this so is my sorry. first attack. Oh. Pretty shit. Oh. Fif oh. Does 15... I don't think 15 pierces my uh, Zora's armor. Uh, let me oh, yeah. let's see. My AC. Oh, no, no actually, my I'm, I'm very wrong. Your AC is 14. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay. Um, so... So that's one hit. Um, that's actually three hits, because that's one attack. Um, I've got... That's not how this works. Oh, is it not? No. Oh, okay, so I roll it three times. Yes! Oh, <laughs> yes, I get to kill him! <laughs> All of those hits. Oh, fuck. <laughs> um, okay, Andy, let me just... Find out how much damage this done. This, this does again. Where have I put? <laughs> Muffins, why do you remember this feat now? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I swear to God, it's just coincidence, right? Like, don't, mm -hmm. don't bother asking. Uh, let's see the damage from your it's double one axe. It's one d eight. Yeah. So I'm gonna roll three d eight. Plus, do I just use my strength bonus and stuff just once? Uh, it's like per per individual attack, so it's you add it three times in the course of this. So I'm doing three d eight plus fifteen. Yep. Okay, Andy. For reference, Zora has thirty one health. Oh no, it's plus eighteen because it's masterwork, isn't it? Is this masterwork double X? Yeah. Yes, it is. Yeah, so it's plus six plus eighteen. Three d eight uh, plus so, eighteen. Hang on. Hang on a second. I'm pretty sure Masterwork only applies to like the attack roll. Oh, is it? Let me it check. does. It it does. Masterwork only applies because yeah, because I you. Okay. I, yeah. So then. yeah, you're fine. It's okay. It's so... only plus fifteen. <laughs> okay. Okay. Just to be a real dickhead right now. Um. Actually, no, no, no. That's fine. That's fine. <laughs> Thirty-one. Ah! <laughs> okay. And so... wait, wait, guys. My second attack. <laughs> Wait, what do you mean your second attack? I've got a second attack. Are you using your second attack? Wait, yeah. it... We don't have to use your Hang... second attack. Hang on. <laughs> um, you rolled one attack, well, three attacks, and I got that, and then you've got another attack? Okay. Yeah, basically... You mean? Okay, you know when That's your base attack attacks, bonus goes level up? Seven. <laughs> At level six. At, at level six, no less. Yeah, yeah. Um, You know when your base attack bonus goes up, right? I and mean, you get yep. a second full attack per round. Yes. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm using six. there. Pardon? Uh, okay, let me work. Let me help you on this one because this is going to take a while to explain. So, I'm pretty sure let's... we've reformed his attack like every single time. No, 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 yeah. no, no. no. Let, let, let me explain yeah. it to you the way that it makes sense to me, right? Basically, um, I'm at plus six slash plus one on my base attack bonus. Which means that I get one uh, weapon attack at plus six, um, plus my other and stuff. And another as well. one at plus one. And another one at plus one. Right. Yes. Now, basically, then, if you if you have the if you are you if you are attacking in two weapon fighting, you suffer a minus six penalty with your regular attack or attacks. So it's both of those. Yeah. And then you get an additional uh, attack that at a minus ten penalty. Yeah, with, uh, and I've got the actual two weapon fighting, which reduces that yeah, which by minus those, two. Yeah, those penalties that reduces by them two. by minus four. So actually, yeah, the first one would have been a thirteen, but it still would have hit Andy on his AC, wouldn't it? Yep. Yeah, and so the second one, 
uh, would be so a all, 21. all told, you have three attacks. So you've just rolled all the damage. No, 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 no. Yep. Yeah, that, that, that's it. Wait, wait. The way that I think about it is, right, because I've got it's two pop. weapons, essentially, <laughs> when I do one attack, I hit with both of those weapons, right? It's like if I was wielding two short swords at the same time. I'd swing them both at the same time. That's what the Orcish double axe is. I, you know, do two attacks with the same weapon, basically. <laughs> what about the chat's like, only, only Zora's pets will be left. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, at, at right. this bit, the entire Zora line will be wiped out. Then Daniel gets in the way and goes, no! <laughs> <laughs> so, so basically, right, the way that I think about it is, is that I've got the um, full weapon attack at plus six bonus, right? Base attack bonus. The full no, weapon attack. No, minus two because of two weapon. Wait, I'm, I'm just. Well, minus four actually, no, no, so I, plus two. I, I, I know that. I know all that. I'm just saying this at like the basics of it. Like, if there were no negatives or positives or anything, I've got my plus six attack roll, and then I've got my plus one attack roll because every time you go up like in a certain amount of levels, you gain another attack roll. Right. It's like a twentieth level. Right. You've usually got four attack rolls if you're a barbarian. Right. And each of those attack rolls encompasses the actual individual weapons hits. Right. One hit for a you know, one for if you're using one weapon, two hits if you're using dual weapons, you know, um, three, like 52 hits if you're using an Uzi. Um, but like, so then the improved two weapon fighting adds on a third hit, right? And then I've got my uh, plus one, okay, bonus, at which point I roll those ones. And um, if you factor in the negatives as well, That'll be at a minus three base attack bonus, minus three base attack bonus, and then I think the next one's at minus five, so then it'll be a minus four base attack bonus. Are you looking at like the stream right now, or like just the the the, the No. No. Oh, oh, oh yeah. yeah. Maths has appeared. Mention two. Who has? Ma. Maths has appeared. Yeah. Is that? That's your three attacks. That bottom back. line is your attack box. Yeah, that's all you've got. Oh, right. That bottom line is with the improved so You don't do two separate attacks, it's so, those ones. Yeah. Yeah, also, you're, you've already dealt 31 damage and your target has dropped. <laughs> okay, well, yeah, he's, he's yeah. dead. Boom. Well, I'm unconscious. Not dead, he's unconscious. No, it's zero and is therefore staggered and bleeding, so. Wait, Very near to it. How many hit Next round, you'll be have? unconscious. 31 exactly. 31. Oh, you had 31 exactly. Yeah. Shit. <laughs> okay, so yes. can, okay, can we get okay? Let's get back to it. Roleplay wise, what the fuck just happened? So exactly role how? Roleplay wise. What did he do? Uh, ro okay, roleplay wise, Mungo, like, you you are certain that Mungo fell under the charm person effect. Mungo then walked forward, wielding his uh. Over his his masterworked uh, orcish double axe, which you know from ex which you like would fear normally, and if you were happens to be Victor Zora, would know rightly to fear, um, and has basically cut across your armor three times by spinning it. Your okay. chest is a heaving and gaping wound. <laughs> okay, well I'm on the floor bleeding, so. You know, my initiative kind of You can you can take over. anything that's like any anything like Oh well you do actually have like the capacity to take an action now. Um if you are presently disabled, you're at zero hit points. Um so you can take only a single move action or standard action, but not both. And you can't take full round actions either. And if you if you can take you can take move actions fine. If you take a standard action, you will, will take one point of damage after completing the action. At, uh, <laughs> and then you'll like be dying basically. Um, so you can move. Can't I? Can't I each turn try? To and you don't like potentially do. Each turn, yes, I, I when you're dying, you can try and stabilize. But right, you're not I'll... presently dying. When it's my it's turn. Else. When it's my turn, I'll... yeah, a little bit. When it's my turn, I'll. Try uh, and stabilize. You was band aid. Okay. <laughs> By the way, guys, as yes. the chat is so rightfully pointing out, blood. 
Mungo. Yeah. Slud. <laughs> Mungo. Rage Tarry. time! Terry, it's your move. The turn has right. only got Mungo on him, by the way. Just so you know. Um, I'm trying to kill him. Oh, do I? Whose turn oh, is it next? It's my guy. After Terry, it is Zora. <laughs> well, I tried to stabilize, so what do I need to roll? A heal check or something? Like uh, no, no, it's, it's Terry. Uh, I haven't taken my right turn now. yet. Oh, sorry, bro. Um, but I don't know what to Why do. Why is the yellow coming in slowly around the outer edges of this room? I don't know. For some <laughs> reason, it's just it's just changed that color. Also, just so you know, the turn order only has Mungo on it. No, it doesn't. It does my side. It has late. And it also has a for Andy as well. Ooh, Go yeah, up in the stream, at least. It's got everybody on mine. Um, he's, he's fine for me now. Mungo is Mungo going to break mine. the fourth wall and kill us all. Right, um... Where am I stood? Just FYI, if I do die, I have the ex I've already come up with an idea of what I'm going to do for the next guy. Wow. <laughs> Should make it interesting. <clears throat> right, yeah, so I'm going to leave it up to the chat for what I do. Oh. <laughs> um, interesting. Right. Basically, I am being pretty much controlled, so I have a sense that I need to, I I need to kill the dwarf. Wait, kill the dwarf. There's two. No. <laughs> There's two dwarfs. I mean, don't be evil. Come on, come on. Go for me. There's two dwarfs. I just realized that. Nice. Go for me. Shit. What was the Odo there right. for? The Odo was there as bait. I can be kind sometimes, Terry. Guys, if thank we're not careful, thank this you. is going to turn into Thank you. I just realised what you did there. Thank you. Um, guys, should go for I... me. Go for me. Should no, I... don't go for you. You're the only one who can fucking dispel this. <laughs> yeah. I should, say. Should You're I the only one who can the heal. Odo? I love the I love the chat sense. <laughs> kill them both. <laughs> <laughs> right, Fine. Thanks, guys. Yeah, Fine. I'll leave it he up is to the not chat. The do only do one I attack Odo or the Odo? I've got like wounds. No, he's the only one who can dispel it. I've yeah, got a wand of pure light wounds. <laughs> Fuck you, you killed me. <laughs> right, I'll, I'll give it a couple minutes. I'll give it a couple, couple minutes. Sacrifice, kill the Odo, kill the Warg. No, the Odo is the Warg. Okay, the well. Yeah, he's not a dwarf, he's a dwarf. Unless. Ah. unless he, he's a, he's a dwarf Mungo. With, the, with the brain of a duck. Look, okay, they're saying kill the Odo. So. Yeah. Right, okay, yeah. I, I just. I've, I hate you all. <laughs> just so you say. know. <laughs> unless it's anybody than stops you Mungo, all. unless anybody stops Mungo, Mungo is just going to proceed to perform a fatality on uh, Zora in his rage. Probably something like ripping his spine out or something. <laughs> <laughs> right, okay, Should there be a struggle? I, I don't think we have to quite I time. I swing over. my sword. Is, is not able to like hold back like Mungo was for like I, ages? I, 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 She's under the influence. That's I why we need you to survive. I can't control this. I've tried to control it. I've I've warned you to get out of the way. That's I am out of the way. I moved over to Zora. I then moved... just wait. Yeah, you and I'm right in front it already. Of you. I can't for the most turn. Right. Okay. I swing my sword towards the Odo. I hate you. I'm sorry. The Odo's. I'm, really, I'm sorry. The oh, Odo's okay. AC is ten. Right. Okay. Uh, what do I need? To uh, okay, guys. Standard attack in, roll. In, in the efforts of, you know, appeasing Monkey in this, can we all just start chanting, roll low, roll no, low? No, I will that's play. One, no, that's one, no that's one. I will roll. I will play the duck sound. <laughs> <laughs> also, just like as a as a point, muffins. Yep. Nothing about your com about your command said you had to slaughter him. <laughs> <laughs> it it said kill, and I'm now in a rage. I've just slaughtered. <laughs> technically, a friend would, of technically your rage I've would count me as a friend, wouldn't it? Is yeah, it? You could have just like attacked once. Friends. Well, did oh. he's dude, dude. charmed? He already considers you a friend. Mongo considers you an extremely close friend at this point, and he's just cut you down. He is yeah. besides himself. So he's not going to attack me again because his rage would consider me as a friend. No, I think at this point he's past that. His his mind is basically broken. Right. Okay. Hold on. If we're going to get into Mongo's... semantics here, how exactly yeah. does this spell work that you've caught? That you don't tell us what it is, but exactly does this spell work that's befallen him? Like, read it um, word for word, sort of thing. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> um, 
basically a creature under this uh, under this spell. Um, they are able you are able to a, a creature under the spell is able to be given uh, commands by an alternative entity, and they continue to attack attempt to carry out that command to the exclusion of all ex activities besides, like, day-to-day -day survival. Um, and beyond that, like, yeah, they resist this control. Any subject forced to take actions against its nature receives a saving throw. So, and it's it's interesting that Elliot never once thought <laughs> about that. <laughs> Oops, I didn't try and resist and it. Self, Shit, the cover's and blurry. And self-destructive self orders are not carried out. I was just enjoying this situation. <laughs> Wait, I, I, I don't have to swing. No, you could try to resist it. Right, oh, I, yes. I, right, okay, I try to resist. I'm not, I'm not attacking. I'm not attacking. Okay, make a will saving throw with a plus two bonus. Please let our always go save them. Double everything so it's, else. Uh, 1d20 plus two. No, 1d20, like your normal will, but plus two. Uh, where's my will save? How many ghosts? What? Why am I not seeing this? Oh, there it is. I'm not gonna lie, this is not how I imagined it. Uh... <laughs> what, you were expecting to go down slower? My end. No, my end. <laughs> <Yeah>. Oh, right. Death by Mungo. Beyond the grave below. Oh, damn. Okay, you are able to resist for the moment. Yeah, <laughs> but I'm, I'm still wielding my sword, so... <laughs> Dodo's not dead yet, guys. Good. <laughs> right, so whose turn Dodo's is it now? <laughs> I don't know, this, the order this is down. Oh no, it's, it's, uh, it's Dragon's turn. It's my turn, right, well, I'll, yeah. what do yeah. I need to roll to no, save No, no, it's, it's my turn, actually. No, go, go, turn. No, go no it's Zora's. Uh, Mungo's the, got uh... the initiative! <laughs> Bongo's got nothing. Um, right, so what is it I need to roll to stabilize? Uh, you're disabled right now, not dying, so you don't have to. You are presently stable. Oh, okay, right. You can just, but if you take a standard action or more, well, you can only take a move or standard action. Taking a standard action will put you into dying state at the end of it. Moving won't, though. Yes. Right. Use okay. band-aids. Moving, moving is fine. Uh, well, 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 I'm not going to move towards... <sighs> okay, well, so I know there's another illusionary wall here, right? You know that there's an illusion on that side, yes. Right, okay, well, how far can I move? Uh, your movement is normal, you're, so you're looking at 30 feet. Oh, jeez, okay. Yeah, you can um... get to that. <laughs> I love the trap yes. right now. Uh... And Muffins needs a slap. <laughs> Muffins is a bad I'm person. I'm assuming, do I, if I do move, if I move this way do i incur like a tax of opportunity yes I do. Or okay. assuming as well i'm guessing <laughs> terry terry doesn't have an order to to order to murder you but i don't no. know that i i do believe in terry i do i do i do believe <laughs> <laughs> i love that and oh if you were uh, like i mungo i presume given his current track record would take the attack of opportunity yep yeah well in that case actually hold on that's a good point only only I think it's only me who knows about the illusionary wall, right? Mm hmm. Because I'm the only one who detected magic and saw it, right? Yep. Okay, well, in that case, I'm going to sort of. We well, imagine he's on, well, imagine he's on the floor, probably clutching his chest and sort of shuffling back with his feet. And I'm going to okay. push myself through the uh, through the wall. I do a spot check now, John. <laughs> <laughs> Mungo's going to take the attack of opportunities. That will happen. No, you before. can't because I didn't go past you. Go fuck yourself. Nope. Yep. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Mungo's gonna take a five foot step through the wall. It's my turn! <laughs> it's not your turn. No, it's not. <laughs> yes! What the hell have is. you got against me today? Mungo's got the initiative, man. <laughs> this is a combat. <laughs> if anything, Mungo should tear you to shreds before you get to move part it's back behind so me. It's my so turn! <laughs> Zora, are you moving the full like distance past yes. that wall? Or? I, well, okay, then. I'm gonna go through the wall and then see what I see in the wall, then choose whether I want to continue. Okay. Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> On the other side, you see the rotting carcass of a purple worm. Oh, it's a rotting carcass. Thank okay. God for that, right? That's a little bit less. Ouch. <laughs> Sorry, swearing. <laughs> okay, um. <laughs> that, would, right that, would, that would have indeed been amazing if it was a live one. <laughs> yeah. That would have been just a case of just. Why are you moving? Because I was basically there. Like, we were right next to each other, man. 
Like, I just forgot to move before. It's not your turn. You I know, here. but I'm... Hey, Mungo, move back. not Wait, no, no, your no, no. turn. How could I have attacked him from there, though? You, no, you attacked me. You I'm on the floor. Free. It's my turn. I'm moving. It's his turn. Yeah. You, you went first, then it was me. Now it's Sora. No, no, no. I, I get that. I'm not disputing that. I'm just, like, he was over here before, right? No. And I was, no, he was here. here. He was right oh, right. He was here. Okay, okay. <laughs> Good luck. Anyway, um, right. Okay, so how far have I moved so far? You've moved about 15. Right, about 15. Okay, so I can move 15, another 15. 20, yeah. Okay. Um, you have not detected anything there, so... Well, I can't detect anything. Yeah. yeah. Um, I'm going to move behind the presumably dead worm, then. <laughs> Screw you, I muffins. <laughs> I see that message. <laughs> <laughs> Using the dead worm's uh, corpse as a shield. <laughs> yeah, hide. Uh, can I cast anything, or is that too much? You've taken your uh, you've taken your move action. If you you cannot take more than one action because you're presently disabled. Uh, if I if I and don't, if you take if a I standard action, you'll be dying. If I don't take my full action, I I still can't, right? Nope. It is just move. So you're 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 done for the moment. All right. So, Odo, your move. Dispel magic. <laughs> no, thank you. Okay. So, dispel magic. You, you can't do it on Zora. You can't... Oh, you can do it on Mungo. Doesn't it's matter. Yeah, it doesn't affect you, does it? Mungo has the worst will save, so yeah. <laughs> okay. Actually, so... I'm raging right now, so my will save's gotten a bit better. A <laughs> little bit. Uh, okay, so there is no saving throw against Dispel Magic. It is an instantaneous duration, and takes a standard action to cast. So, would you like to make a Dispel check, Odo? Please. That is oh. 1d20 plus 7 for you. Slash roll 1d20 plus 7. Dis <laughs> Hello, my name is Zora. You killed my brother. Prepare to die. <laughs> Zora, what? That wouldn't make sense. J jumping Jack uh, with the worm. Oh, 26. Right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I have mildly bad news. The DC is 27. Oh, you fucker. <laughs> so, you cast it at Mungo, and you definitely detect that there is indeed something to remove, but you land... Very just shy of actually removing it. So basically, I didn't get a nut for that even to work. Move basically. back. Move away from me. No need to talk right into the microphone. I need to. She's doing it for emphasis. One man, one desire. I don't want to hurt you. After order. Andy. Suddenly, death reigns from above, from pots and pans fall all over the world! Andy. Uh huh. Do you want to put on the Jaws theme tune? <laughs> sure. Adam. Read the chat. Uh, we Adam. Read the um, by the way, like, what, what does it take for me? What, what would it count for me to just, dro to just drop an item of some kind? What kind of action? It's a free action. Have? It's a free action. Actually, okay. that, that, that's true. He would have to roll a nat 20. Yeah, he would have to roll a nat 20 to get it, which is ridiculous. And sorry, that's not a rule I've made. Oh, no, that's I know, like, I know. That's I the letter of Dispel Magic. I, I'm not blaming you. It's yeah. still guys, it's got me ridiculous. nothing, guys. It's ridiculous, isn't it? <laughs> guys, Terrible. is it my turn yet? Well, I'm guessing Odo's done. He can move. 19 got me bugger all. Do something else. I don't care what it is. I'm going to... Wait, Tari's there. Haven't you got, haven't you got a snaring there. spell of some kind? He's already used this spell. No, he's used a spell yeah, as a standard oh. action. You, get, you can get up to two standard actions per turn. Stop trying to kill me, you bastard. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, I love my job. Yeah, well, the, wait, wait. The last time Terry attacked a human, I, she cut his hand off, then beheaded him. Run, Odo, run. <laughs> I've warned him. I have told him to run. <laughs> I have uh, something I can use, actually. Just realized. Oh? Um... I had something which, it's like, yeah, Tanglefoot. 
tango foot. A tango foot bag. Ah, we know these things. Yeah, I remember those yes, things. Yes, we do. They stop people from moving. I remember this. <laughs> um, so yeah. Do it, I'm, do it on Mongo. Do it on I'm going to use my tango foot bag. Uh, who's got the hardest punch again? Oh yeah, Mongo. <laughs> so, Definitely Mongo. <laughs> wait, wait. It, no, wait. Uh, tango foot does a radius of how much? Mm-hmm. Uh, it has a ranged increase. It has a ranged touch attack. With a, it's yeah. You yeah, throw right. it with a range increment of ten feet, and uh, you have to hit a creature with it. Well, I can definitely hit so either of those so, two because they're within the range. Yeah. Um, and then how much range does the tangle foot cover when it lands? It only entangles one person. I thought it was two. Wait, wasn't but, it? Oh, no. Gosh. No, it was just that you were the only person worth worth targeting the last time these came up. Thank God. <laughs> uh, do I have something else I could do two people? Now, Tari has the Tari has the better will save, so she can re continue to resist these commands the more she, as long as she tries to. Yeah. Mungo is the big issue here. Yeah, I, I suggest doing it towards Mungo. You need to stop him from killing. He he's on a he's basically on a rampage right now. He he wants to kill Zora. Or I could just meld into stone. <laughs> <laughs> don't be a dick. <laughs> no, no, Do I used to. Really think stone can hold Mungo? <laughs> uh, yes. Andy, Andy's already <laughs> lost a character. Come on. I used to angle farts on Mungo. I'm nice. Okay, Mungo, would you like to make a DC 15 reflex save? To, yeah, you know, I'm to ready, be fair, man. I lost the character due to my own choice. Nisha, yeah, I do. I, I do. I do still have the shield. <laughs> Fine. Yeah, I just remember. Fine. I was already prepared and I've passed. <laughs> okay, so you're not glued to the floor, unable to move. Yep. But you can only move at half speed. That's fine. So that's 15 feet. Uh, yep, that's uh, fine. Um, Lying, before you yep. go there, can I just describe what I was going to do? Please. Jump into the okay. vortex. As we all know, Mungo is not a very intelligent man. No. Uh, especially when he's under the effects of his rage. Yep. He cannot see the sorcerer. The yep. sorcerer no longer exists. You're saying that Mungo has no sense of object permanence? Well, not when he's raging. I Fair mean, enough. think about think about him in all these bar fights and stuff. Yeah, true enough. When was no, the last he time knows... a died in this stream? Something like, what, ten streams ago at least? Yeah. yeah, and that was due to my character kind of leaving of his own free yeah. mission. Before that was quite a ways ago. That was Ame. Yeah. He actually died to the worm which I am presently cowering behind. Yeah, in fact. We've come However, full circle. We hit full circle. <laughs> a wimber way. However, Mongo is not a rage, and he will attack anything that isn't a friend. Okay. <laughs> Everyone in this room you qualify as a friend. Yes, but there is something in this. You're going to attack the Swirly Vortex? Yes. Okay, then. That's an entity. <laughs> uh, it doesn't need to be. Mongo's going to attack it. It's a thing. It's moving. Well, it's, it's not a friend. It's animated, I guess, might be the yep. best description. Yep. It's, it's moving. moving. Is a, is a...